shelf, and then I on the shelf I'm going to put the yeah uh, uh, charge controller and the uh, inverter charger. That looks great. You did a great job. Hello, my friends. This is Mike from Seawater Pro. We're looking at uh, Chuck's Dixon's setup. Uh, he uh, Chuck went with two pumps. One is a 110 AC, and the other one is a 12 volt DC. And uh, what we do here is we just pull the uh, quick disconnect from one pump, and then we go to the other. Just flip it around, and there you go. Now we're running on the 12 volt, and there is also a three-way valve here that switches the uh, water supply from from uh, the uh, 110 to the uh, 12 volt. Just as simple as removing a quick disconnect. And now you're in a 12 volt system. And here are the, his switches. This is his uh, priming the boost pump switch. This is the 110 volt switch and this is the uh, 12 volt switch. And it's all contained in a, how big is this box? Oh, I don't know, 44 by, I don't know, 40, 48 or something. 44 by 28 something yeah, box. And it's, uh, then he made a shelf here for keeping everything uh, under and uh, here's the shelf. I love the simplicity of this. Oh yeah, that's the shelf. And a charger on top for the solar panels. You run everything off solar. Yeah, and then we have his uh, solar panels up here. Let's go take another look at this. There is the setup with the two solar panels. And uh, how big is this boat? 31 foot. 31. Everything will run off the solar. Yeah, that's... And here is the box with the, the two pumps under. And Chuck went with the uh, dual membrane, dual 21 inch membrane instead of a single 40. So he gets about uh, the same performance as a single 40. Thank you for watching.